in corporate finance, economic value added, is an estimate of a firm's economic profit a euro being the value created in excess of the required return of a company's investors. Quite simply, EVA is the profit earned by the firm less the cost of financing the firm's capital. The idea is that value is created when the return on the firm's economic capital employed is greater than the cost of that capital. This amount can be determined by making adjustments to GAAP accounting. There are potentially over 160 adjustments that could be made but in practice only five or seven key ones are made, depending on the company in the industry it competes in. Calculation EVA is net operating profit after tax is lesser capital charge, the latter being the product of the cost of capital and the economic capital. The basic formula is where is the return on invested capital? Is the weighted average cost of capital? Is the economic capital employed? NOPAT is the net operating profit after tax, with adjustments and translations, generally for the amortization of goodwill, the capitalization of brand advertising and other non-cash items. EVA calculation, Z, EVA equals net operating profit after tax is a euro a capital charge. The residual income method, therefore EVA equals NOPAT a euro, or alternatively, EVA equals a euro so that, EVA equals a, capital, the spread method, or excess return method, where, R equals rate of return, and, C equals cost of capital, or the weighted average cost of capital. NOPAT is profits derived from a Campania Euro unregistered trademark S operations after cash taxes but before financing costs and non-cash bookkeeping entries. It is the total pool of profits available to provide a cash return to those who provide capital to the firm. Capital is the amount of cash invested in the business, net of depreciation. It can be calculated as the sum of interest-bearing debt and equity or as the sum of net assets less non-interest-bearing current liabilities. The capital charge is the cash flow required to compensate investors for the riskiness of the business given the amount of economic capital invested. The cost of capital is the minimum rate of return on capital required to compensate investors for bearing risk, their opportunity cost. Another perspective on EVA can be gained by looking at a firm a Euro unregistered trademark S return on net assets. RONA is a ratio that is calculated by dividing a firm a Euro unregistered trademark S NOPAT by the amount of capital it employs after making the necessary adjustments of the data reported by a conventional financial accounting system. EVA equals a net investments, if RONA is above the threshold rate, EVA is positive. Comparison with other approaches, other approaches along similar lines include residual income valuation and residual cash flow. Although EVA is similar to residual income, under some definitions there may be minor technical differences between EVA and RI. Residual cash flow is another, much older term for economic profit. In all three cases, money cost of capital refers to the amount of money rather than the proportional cost. At the same time, the adjustments to NOPAT are unique to EVA. Although in concept, these approaches are in a sense nothing more than the traditional, common sense idea of profit, the utility of having a separate and more precisely defined term such as EVA is that it makes a clear separation from dubious accounting adjustments that have enabled businesses such as Enron to report profits while actually approaching insolvency. Other measures of shareholder value include, added value, market value added, total shareholder return, market value added, the firm's market value added, or MVA, is the discounted sum of all future expected economic value added. Note that MVA equals PV of EVA. More enlightening is that since MVA equals NPV of free cash flow it follows therefore that the NPV of FCF equals PV of EVA. Since after all, EVA is simply the rearrangement of the FCF formula. Process-based costing, in 2012, Mochkiaro Leadistry, Picon and Miner proposed a performance and cost measurement system that integrates the EVA criteria with process-based costing. The EVA PBC methodology allows us to implement the EVA management logic not only at the firm level, but also at lower levels of the organization. 
EVA PBC methodology plays an interesting role in bringing strategy back into financial performance measures. See also, business valuation, enterprise value, opportunity cost, value added, references, Mochkiaro Lidistri A, Picon PM. And Minor A, bringing strategy back into financial systems of performance measurement, integrating EVA and PBC, business system review, Vol 1. Issue 1 pages 85 to 102 HTTP, Papers SSRN Compapers CFM. Abstracted equals 2,154,117. G. Bennett Stewart 3. Best Practice EVA. John Wiley and Sansa, G. Bennett Stewart 3. The Quest for Value. Harper Collins, Eric Stern. The Value Mindset. Wiley. -er. Joel Stern and John Chile. The EVA Challenge. Wiley, Alair Barr. EVA, The Real Key to Creating Wealth. Wiley, External Links, A Reading List on EVA Value-Based Management from Robert Korakuk, Economic Value Added from G. Bennett Stewart III and EVA Dimensions LLC, Economic Value Added, Professor Aswath Damodaran, EVA Valuation Tutorial from Valuatum.com, Understanding Economic Value Added, Investopedia.com, All About EVA, Investopedia.com, EVA WACC Tree Model Infographic Visually, Economic Value Added, A Simulation Analysis of the Trendy, Owner Oriented Management Tool, Timo Sami and ILKK Aberton, 2001, The Origins of EVA Chicago Booth Magazine.